Hey guys, welcome to Nothing But Cardboard. John Sr. here. Still not liking that name. I'm gonna have to, maybe we'll have something to get a better name since there's two Johns. Anyway, I'm gonna show you how to do the QR codes on eBay so you can save on ink, um, paper, whatever, to print out the QR codes to take it to the post office to have them put everything on here. I'm gonna show you the whole thing all the way through, even at the post office, what happens there. Because sometimes when you go in, they're like, I don't know how to do this. How do you do it? You'll actually be able to show them how to do it. So it's a new feature that lets you get your discount on eBay, but go to the post office and get a free label that they put on side. So once you do what I'm going to show you on eBay, it's going to give you a, a QR code. If you're going to do multiple items, like if you're going to do three or four and don't take 10 or 15 of these to the post office and expect them to sit there and scan them and put them in. I would think five or less. If you got that many, then you probably need to get a printer and print them out yourself. But if you have five or less, you can do this and take them to the post office. Once you click buy the QR code, which I'm gonna show you in the video in a minute, write that QR code on here. So when you get to the post office and they're ready to scan it, you can hand on the package and make sure they're getting it. You don't wanna send a Joe Burrow select PSA 10 to some guy that bought a 1990 Mark McGuire Donruss whatever regular card. You don't want to make that mistake. Trying to get your card back is going to be a pain, but then all your, your hassle and stuff. So you want to make sure you send the right package to the right person if you're doing multiple items. Hopefully this content helps you. Share it with somebody else that will help them and let's just... Uh, keep the uh, hobby going you have to be on a website you can't be on an app for this print shipping labels this is the item I'm selling you want to make sure the package is right mine are three ounces it's a bubble mailer it's just the one card in there you could do you know if you do a single card and you want to mail it the eBay letter rate you can do that so you're just making sure this is right shipping format here's where you, you click on QR code then I'm gonna put Click on purchase shipping label. When you click on the purchase shipping label, it's gonna email you the QR code to your phone. I'll open my email and I'll click a picture of that and just save it in my images. That's easier than me at the post office trying to open my email and find the right one. Again, if you're doing multiple QR codes, you wanna write the QR code on the package to make sure it matches. They also send a picture of the item you're mailing in the QR code. So when I when I try to save the picture on my phone, I have the QR code and then the very top of what the item is below just so I can double check it. Another feature here, depending on where you're at, underneath shipping label format, you can click on nearby USPS locations. This will tell you where they accept the QR codes based on where you're at. So for me, this is where the post offices are that accept the QR codes and I actually I know for sure there's another one because my post office is the Loops post office and it um it it does it also so this is actually from our nothing but cardboard which is located in Newport Ritchie so this is actually accurate for where the closest ones are for there all right guys we're at the post office we're gonna go inside and I'm gonna show you exactly what to do with your eBay to scan the label some people are nervous, and if you know what to do ahead of time, then it just makes it so much easier. So let's go inside, and I'll show you what happens next. And of course, I'm early, so we'll just have to wait a minute till they open. Yep, surprise, it's me. All right, so we're inside. I'm going to show you how to do the label broker, so when you get here, you know what you're doing. You're just going to walk up to the window. I don't know if you can reach a scale from outside or not depending on how the post office has it set up. You're gonna bring up the broker on your phone. Once your thing is on the scale, the clerk will scan your ID. And you print your free label. Label printed correctly. Print your receipt. Your receipt has a tracking number on it, shows you mailed it. 
clerk will put the label on your package and mail it for you. So I hope this helps. I still